to the audience. So that the audience would simply commit to believing, well, that's Thor and that's Loki. Mm -hmm. We've never seen them before. They look like interesting you know, characters. Um, and it was the characters that, were, that needed to be cast rather than casting an already big name movie star as that uh, character. So there was a kind of excitement in the community because there was a sense of like, oh, there's, a, there's opportunity here. Yeah. There's, they're going for actors who, who haven't done big movies. So there was a real sense. And there was a group of us, and every single one of those actors has gone on to have an extraordinary career. Um, Alexander Skarsgård, Charlie Hunnam, wow. um, yeah. Liam Hemsworth, um, <laughs> like Chris Hemsworth. Yeah. Um, so it was yeah, very exciting, and I remember that I think I, I've said this before, but um, I signed my contract uh, before going in for my screen test, and on the front page it said uh, something to this effect: um, Marvel Studios uh, retains the right to cast Tom Hiddleston in the role of, and there was a blank, and somebody had written Thor slash Loki. And I thought, well, no one told me about that. Um, so it was already something they were thinking about. Wow. Yeah. It, that's so interesting, though, because